Hey everybody, welcome to Kirchberg Mini Farms. Today's that day. It is hay day again. We're getting 500 square bales of hay for the cattle this winter and 36 rounds. And they, they see all the hay, so they're raising a little cane. What they didn't realize is I dropped some over here. Wilbur found it. See Wilbur? Wilbur's right there eating it up. They'll figure it out eventually. Anyways, here we are. We're gonna get hay stacked in the barn. As you guys know, that's not what this barn was intended for. This barn was intended for animals, concrete floor. Didn't make it there this year. So, here's what we got. Got these hay bales here. Got a nice place to store hay this year. So, I got 204 bales, I think, stacked up here. And then these bales on the trailer, they're gonna come back here. So we're gonna stack them back here and then our rounds will go on this side. That'll leave the center aisle open for anything we wanna do. Well, as a matter of fact, that messes up my theory. Huh. I wanted to have this whole section back here blocked off for the cattle, but I'm gonna have to stack some hay back here. I'm not gonna have a choice. <coughs> Woo. <coughs> Woo. Anyways, I don't have a choice. I'm gonna have to stack some hay back here because I'm gonna run out of space and then we'll put the round bales hopefully over here. <coughs> Ooh, hay allergies. I wanna leave this open for the cattle for shelter. So we made it. <coughs> oh. Oh. I love this stuff, but I'm allergic to it. We may end up having to pile some hay right here in the center. I, I was wanting to leave the center aisle open and clear. The center aisle here is 16 foot wide. Each lean-to is 12 foot. So we have 12 foot worth of hay deep going that way and 20 foot wide. So we got a 12 by 20, 240 square feet. Is my math right? Of hay there. I'm hoping to put the rest of the hay back here and then we'll put the rounds over here. I may end up putting the rounds in the middle. Um, I was trying to keep it open so I could run a tractor or anything in, be able to feed the cattle back here, but I'm not sure gonna be able to do it. So here I go. You guys are gonna see it. The before, you'll see a full hay trailer. And when I get back to you, cause I can't hold the camera and throw hay, I'll show you all the hay stacked up and off the trailer. All right, well, see Piper and Jody cleaning off what's left of the trailer. Not hay left, no hay left. What? Would you guys like to come with me to see Christopher eat out of my hand with hay? go now showing the barn and all the hard work we did of course he wants it from his piper <laughs> all right let's go check out the barn Here we are, here's the after. Boom, full from the door up, all the way down to here. So we moved everything that was on that trailer right into here. So now we have a little over 300 bales, 200 more to go, and some round bales. As you can see, I'm a little hot, tired, scorching like 90 something degrees outside we're slinging hay in the sun it's warm but uh that's it to, for today's episode of kirchberg mini farms you got to see us stack some hay and get ready for winter i'm kip i'm piper make sure you like and subscribe we'll see you next time bye bye Ooh, sweating pretty good yeah hard work and sweat Builds character, don't it? <laughs>